On the Livingston, Booyah, look at this beauty. In today's episode, my wife is giving birth. Baby's uh, heart rate dropped again. Ooh. Oh, I'm on, I'm on, I'm on. I just wanna say thank you to Dr. Bestard and also the staff at the hospital. Ultimately, the decision to have the C-section right away uh, is what saved my baby's life and uh we will forever be grateful to you but now guys enjoy the episode i've got fishing i've got my wife giving birth and uh that's it let's get into it Yeah, he smacked it from behind, just like we like it. Welcome back to another episode of CEO Fishing. In today's episode, my wife is giving birth. So stay tuned, it's gonna be fun, and hopefully I can go fishing. Are you ready, babe? I think that's a yes. <laughs> if I live through the night, I will make an awesome video for you guys. You don't wanna smile at the camera? Babe, we're having a baby. I'm here with you. I feel everything you feel. Everything you feel. Oh, shit. Oh, the dads get to sleep on these luxury uh, chairs and couches. So we're getting into the late night, early morning hours. And uh, she still hasn't had the baby yet. So uh, I'll keep you guys posted. She's enjoying herself. Mama Bear came to visit. <laughs> Babe, you're glowing. She's this is my daughter. We ended up having to go to an emergency C-section. The baby's heart rate was dropping and he was losing oxygen, but everything worked out. There he is, this little baby boy. Sleeping, but uh, there's a nice little fisherman right there. Fisherman, soccer player, daddy's little boy. And everyone who watches my channel, you guys know that I'm a family man. So you're gonna be seeing a lot of this little guy in all of the videos from his first catch, the first time learning how to use a fishing rod, how to kick a soccer ball and all of that. Enjoy this episode and uh, that's it. If you like fishing in the outdoors, make sure you hit subscribe and turn the notification bell on right now. All right, we survived night one of having the baby at the house. Kai, uh, he wasn't bad. It wasn't that he was crying a lot, it was that he was a lot more alert for most of the night and wanted to be held. So the only time that I finally got to close my eyes for a few minutes was when Giselle was uh, breastfeeding and I said, babe, could I please try to get 15 minutes of sleep? <laughs> and then uh, we kind of switched off um, once she was done breastfeeding and I held him, you know, took nice two nice little dumps during the course of the night. But finally, I'd say what, around five o'clock in the morning, I was able to get him into his bed and he uh, stayed. Day two, or is it three? home with the baby. I think it's day two. My wife just said it was day two. We just want to sleep. Family's at the house. That means daddy's got time to go fishing. So as some of you guys who've been following the channel, you guys know that my wife and I were trying to have a baby for a couple years. Um, and 
unfortunately we had she had but i say we because we're in this together two miscarriages and we sort of gave up on the process and then she got pregnant again and now we find ourselves the parents of a brand new baby boy kai asher and couldn't be more excited but also couldn't be more tired you know uh i've had kids before so i i i know that there's sleepless nights and stuff but i got a 20 year old and a 16 year old and having a newborn crying at night whew, it's tough you know my wife and i haven't slept in a few days uh but fortunately i got cuban coffee to keep me awake i've got family at the house so i decided to get out get some sunshine and go fishing Come on, come on, come on. Hallelujah. Oh, nice, nice. Oh, shoot. What a fight. There it is. Got me a peacock bass. Right there. On the swim bait. You know, just had to get out of the house for a little bit. So I could, uh, just get some fresh air. Been in a hospital for days, no sleep, and uh, I really needed that. That was out of nowhere because uh, I was actually looking at a different fish. I would love to get something else, but if that's the only fish I get today, I'm happy because I came out to catch a fish, and I'd say that just happened. So I can go home happy. Go clean up, hold my baby. But man, I haven't had sleep in several days, so I needed this little peace of mind. That's what the in-laws and uh, the family is for. They come over, they help out. And uh, my wife and I, we don't get to relax, but we do get some peace of mind that there's people around us that are willing to help. I just got to sneak out of the house for a moment to see if I can catch something. I got my parents there, my in-laws, but you know what? Daddy needs to catch a fish because daddy hasn't gone fishing in a while. Really cool fish right here. Got him, got him, got him, got it. This is a really neat fish that we have in these South Florida waters. Beautiful, beautiful colors. And I'm gonna show them to you right now. Flip them up. Oh, look at the beautiful color of this fish. Wow. Wow, what a gorgeous specimen right here. Oh, thank you, buddy. Thank you for the fight. You know? Look at this. Look at this beauty. Man. Well, on that note, I'm gonna go back to my house, wash my hands, take a shower, and hold my baby. Thank you for watching. Thank you for watching the episode, guys. I hope you really enjoyed it. You know, this channel is gonna be, there's gonna be a lot of stuff about my life and my family as well, uh, in addition to all the fishing. So like I said before, if you like that type of content, make sure you hit subscribe and turn your notification bell on right now. And if you wanna help support the channel and my new baby, you can go to the Instagram shop and uh, buy some products there or go directly to ceofishing.com and buy t-shirts, hats, and uh, some other stuff that's up there. So uh, I really appreciate you guys. And until next time, keep your head up, keep moving forward in tight lines. Zzz.